It was a cold January morning. The icy air of China made me shiver as I walked into this orphanage. As I stepped inside, nothing could have ever prepared me for what I was about to see. I walked down this dimly lit concrete hall with nothing around besides some dust on the floors. But what I saw next has forever changed me. Inside a small concrete room, I saw one barred window and about 15 chairs. But the people I saw in that room shattered me, crushed me, and shook me to the core. On those chairs sat teen and young adult men with special needs. All life was stripped from their faces. No hope was seen in their eyes. They sat unable to move or experience life. They were locked away. Outside that room stood a guard, frozen like a stone. His job was to keep the people in, and that's what he did. And it was at that moment I knew my life could never be the same. I had seen the pictures and I had heard the stories, but seeing it in real life shook me, because this is how many orphans live. They are locked away in rooms, tied to cribs, starved, deprived of love, and left alone to wither away. They have no love, family, or future. They are labeled, and because of those labels, they are left alone, never to be seen by the world. And although many times people see the cute pictures of babies needing homes, the reality is there are those who are older, have special needs, and are dying in orphanages all over. These kids are hurting, and I share this story with you today to ask if you are willing to help make a change. We can't keep looking at these orphans and say it's not our job or it's not our calling. I once heard this quote that said something like this, we are all called to adopt unless God clearly tells us not to. So unless God has told you not to, you must also help the orphan. We can't keep doing the simple things like writing the checks or making the meals. Now though those aren't bad things, we must do more. We must stop walking and we must start running. We are the hands and feet of Jesus. You see, I don't want to end this video on a sad note, because let me tell you this, orphans can change. The life of brokenness they once knew doesn't have to be the broken life they keep living. The love of a family changes these kids. These orphans will grow to be made new. You will see the most beautiful transformation. So we as Christians must step out and learn to love on these kids. Let's be the hands and feet of Jesus. Let's make a difference.